Hi, my name is Caroline Kinsey. I was born in 1968, 28th of March. I was born a hermaphrodite, which means it's a person or animal or a plant that characteristics of two sexual organs. I grew up as a boy, which I shouldn't have, which the secrets were kept from me for 41 years as a boy and 41 years as Carl. It didn't feel right because I didn't feel right in men's clothes. So after 41 years, I decided to take a challenge and put women's clothes on the next day on Easter in April 2010. My first dress I wore was a pink dress because I was going towards the job centre and people started to stare, what an idiot. And then I said, no, don't bother, go home. Tried it twice and I went straight into the job centre and I never bothered. Walked out and I thought, I'm proud, I've just done it. And that was it. But since that year, I started to wear women's clothes because I knew I was a real woman. I feel more happier than ever. I feel more healthier. And I don't even look back into my past because I don't want to remember it. That's all I want to do is want to forget. Me and Lynn met at college. We became boyfriend and girlfriend in 1986. But during our years of our marriage, things weren't, feeling, weren't going right. We weren't, fall, we weren't in love with each other. And then we divorced two years later on December the 16th, 2010. People in the streets that have abused me, it's not just women. They don't say anything. It's just the men. Every time I walk past, they always say, hey, tranny, or weirdo, or, or whatever. And sometimes they'll always be behind my, they'll always be behind my back saying, come on, I want to knock yourself, I want to knock your seven bells out of you, I want to knock you in. Come on, turn around so I can hit you. But then I just ignore it and continue walking, that's how it all is. But some women sometimes stare at me thinking, hey. elderly women look at me, people smile at me and they'll think, hmm, he's all right, he wears nice clothes, better than the others. But it's just men, though, when every time I walk past, they always want to keep me facing or call me on everything they want. That's what people are like in the streets. For 43, for 43 years, I felt like committing suicide, even from a young child age, because I've had enough of being bullied, picked on, and abused, and everything else, I had enough. So I grew up to turn to commit suicide, but I didn't do it, because I wanted to know if it was true or not. That's all I can say. For 43 years, I just wanted to commit suicide. It just made me angry. Furious. I just wanted to keep people in. Sorry, Cal. Sorry. I want to get rid of my male part, just to have this operation, to have a female part that I should have had in 68. But in my future, I want to continue as I am. Well, I wanted to be anyway.